Hello, everybody. This is Ben Hansen with MinMax. Obviously, a lot of us are stuck at home, and we don't know when that's going to change in the future. Um, I know I'm missing my regular tabletop board game nights, so we thought as a kind gesture here from MinMax that we would make our previously Patreon-exclusive tabletop streams public. So these are kind of reposting if you're paying attention to the Patreon, but for a lot of folks, probably going to be the first time you see us play tabletop games here at MinMax, which is a core part of what we do. Um, and so we're making it public. Obviously, if you appreciate it, you appreciate us, you want us to get bigger and better in these trying times, any support at patreon.com slash minmax2ends would be appreciated. As you can probably tell, the tone for these tabletop streams are a little more subdued. But for the stream, we're playing Camel Up, which is Jeffum's favorite tabletop game of all time, and we're playing with my old friends Grant and Amy and Jeff Marchiafava, you know the drill. But without further ado, I hope you enjoy watching some friends play a tabletop game. Tristan will be monitoring chat, but overall, mm -hmm. this is going to be a little bit more relaxed. It's not going to be a action-packed mile a minute like our no. great goatee hunt streams where it's, it's a bunch of grab ass and tomfoolery. Yeah, no grabbing ass tonight for sure. <laughs> but that's why that we, we like That we can to promise watch. you. Except for camel ass, I guess. Yeah. Oh, be. sweet camel grabbing ass. ass. Nothing like ape out here, just camels. <laughs> no. This is your favorite tabletop game of all time, Jeff. Yeah, I mean, when I was put on the spot, this is the one I called out just because I think it plays well with a large number of people. Mm -hmm. It's fast. It's not too many rules. And it's kind of exciting the entire way through because you never know what's going to happen with these camels. So. Yeah. Do you want to give like a brief overview? Like we all know how to play. So I think we'll move along and people will get the idea. But I think people yeah. wanted a lay of the land if they're not familiar with camel. Yeah. So basically there are a ton of camels. We will be – there are a bunch of colored dice in this pyramid um, that will be coming out one at a time. And the camels will be moving around. And we are all basically just betting on which camel we think is going to pass the finish line the first. Tristan, this is when you cut to the overhead camera. There we go. All right. There you're we on go. Yeah. So we got – little camels here they'll be going and also if you can see they stack on top of each other which also messes up who's in first and which way people are going because who's on top is in first is in first place right yes. and it's very important that everybody knows that when camels are stacked up it's called camel unit see, 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 see unit. <laughs> i'm glad you guys have that joke worked out ahead of time. yeah we have a bunch of jokes <laughs> we're sliding Perfect, across yes. the table towards each other uh and so th i just learned this about the game that my favorite aspect the uh negative camels the, the crazy camels, camels the yes. crazy camels from hell over there um which canonically are in the afterlife and are working their way back because they're camels that have been yes. raced to death right yeah that, that's, that's true that's true yep yeah, mm -hmm. you got to read the Camel Up novel. <laughs> it's a <But> second edition <laughs> lore. This is a guess, so it's a second edition thing. That this yeah. is like, did you play the first well, edition or? It, it was originally an expansion in the first edition, and okay. so they just kind of bundled them together into the second edition. Yes. That's very smart because I could not imagine. I mean, it seems like a fun game, but that is really the coup de gras that there is having up. your nightmare camels rounded around the That's track. That's right. Uh, <laughs> Haunting me. Also, did you show how the dice come out of that fucking thing? Yeah, you. It's basically the entryway, right? So you like shake it and then you press it and one die will come out at a time. And only, so there's a color for each one and then there is a crazy die that controls both the black and the white. But basically only five of the six dice will come out every leg. Right. We're all, we should say we're also betting on individual legs. So after five dice are out, we will have all been betting on which camel's in first and which camel's in second. Because so, that's the confusing thing is you think, oh, you're role-playing as the camel, but that's not the case. You're no, role-playing yep. as the rich uh, oil baron who's gambling who's on the camel. On which one's going to win, okay, yes. Okay, great. Uh, can we figure out who's who? Yeah, Let's we have a bunch of characters that we have to pick from. Now, you want to be the biggest pervert? Is that what you uh, <laughs> yeah, proclaim yeah. to the heavens before <laughs> yeah, the stream started? That's this guy, definitely. Okay, great. <laughs> great. <laughs> He's I'll got take... a cool hat and a mustache. Mm -hmm. I'll he, take a... His expression screams pervert. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have the least pervert one? Uh, boy, that's a real tough call. That might be this cute lady. Mm. Or maybe a grandma. I've, I've heard things about no, her. No, that grandma is definitely <laughs> more perverted. <laughs> yeah. This guy, we're going against type here a little bit. Yeah, he's I think kinda he's kind of like a, a businessman. Yeah. Please. No businessman's ever been perverted. The of the bunch. I'd like to be the elderly gentleman with the mustache. Mm. The non pervy The mustache. asexual gentleman he's known <laughs> yes. as. Hold on, that's so grabbed can... by the hump right there. <laughs> is it? <laughs> it is. Can... Uh, and I'm choosing this lovely lady. We can get rid of those. That's and so basically stack. what these are is we have five cards here that each have a different color on them. And this is the way that we're going to be betting on who is the final camel or who's the camel that's going to win. And so you can bet at any time. And if you bet... Early, you'll get more points, but it or coins. And if you, 
but if you're wrong, you're going to lose them. And so the entire game kind of boils down to betting when you think you're sure and then finding out that you are actually wrong and the camel right. you bet on is in last place. Yeah, I mean, I think this game is more complicated than I expected getting out of the gate, and then, you know, it takes a round and you get it. Oh. But mm -hmm. it's that idea of, like, all this game is realistically is just betting a lot on certain dice rolls and then getting effed very yes. hard by the dice Yep, that are in King Tut's tomb. Yeah, that's right. That's basically how it works. Uh, and I... What happened to... Are we missing friends? Oh, yeah. I had the wrong. We also have one token here that you can put out on a desert space. And basically, if a camel lands on it, they will go an extra space or they will go back one space, depending on whether you are cheering or booing for the camel. Oh, is that the lore? I've never noticed that. Yep. It's just like an oil slick in my mind for Mario Kart or like <laughs> yeah. something super simple like that. And everything kind of also gives you coins as you're doing all of this. And so there's... A little more strategy there too of well are you going to make a bet that's probably going to go against you or are you yeah. just going to roll the dice and get a coin for that basically right. and that kind of stuff but it's whoever has the most coins at the end just yeah. like real life and you um you have a long history with camels isn't that right yeah i used to raise them yes, yes. does that work for you fascinating <laughs> hey look we never promised comedy <laughs> that's <laughs> right uh who wants to go first? You. Okay. Yeah. Uh, then in that case, I'm going to bet it all. <laughs> <laughs> I will just roll. Uh, so I will take one of these, which tells me I get a coin at the end of the turn. It's the very safe, boring play. Yes. We got we to start things going. So that's three. One, two, three. And so these were randomly assigned based on rolls yep. to figure out where these camels are mm -hmm. going to be starting with. And then this, I think, goes is supposed to go on one of the tents. Everybody knows the dice goes on top of the tent. Yeah. That's the way it works. Take it away, Amy. Oh, I'm taking it to the next level. One, two, three. So that whole camel yep. unit went for it. And so now right. you will notice that purple just went from first to almost last place. <laughs> it's almost like Sad. this game is wildly unpredictable. Yes. And so the entire stack, whoever's riding on uh, old Greeny here is going along for the ride. And that's the way that works. Tristan, I'm paranoid on a technical level. Does the chat seem confident that it's working technically fine and they can see everything and hear everything okay? No, no one's complaining. Great. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. We'll Tristan see. says everyone's complaining. We'll take Are there people to complain? <laughs> <laughs> Two people watching. That's a good question One as well. camel <laughs> fan just was Googling and came across this supposedly private stream. Oh, camel racing it. <laughs> well, Sign uh, me up. Grant went, so it's your turn. I don't really feel like it. I think I'm going to pass on this one. No, what did you do? I took a blue token. So Grant mm. is feeling so confident that blue is going to win this round, which is just when the tents are all full. Yeah. That mm -hmm. he's going for blue. And honestly, that's a really good. Well, Grant, I don't think you noticed uh, old red bone <laughs> back there. Yeah. Dark horse or dark camel, excuse me. <laughs> it looks like uh, these are also come out like the earlier one that you take will give you more coins. Yeah, I wonder. Yeah, Let's can see you? This. Can people see? Uh, Will it autofocus to it? It's working. You can see it. It's a little dark, but yeah. a little. So yeah. as you go down, then it's worth less and less. Yeah. If you choose incorrectly too, if you if you bet on the third or fourth place or fourth or fifth place camel, you lose money then too. Mm -hmm. That's yeah, right. It has to be first or second place for you for that to actually pay out for you. Right. If you're not first, you're last. Yeah. Is the overall lesson here. Uh, uh, I started the last game we played negative. That, that was a first. <laughs> <laughs> oh, were we supposed to start with coins? I don't no. know. We never have. Wait, we never We probably have. don't we have to, right? We've Wait, do you normally do that? Um, <laughs> We've all played the game, but don't know how to play it. <laughs> yeah, I can't remember if you do. Maybe because because you can lose coins That's true. at the end of well, the first. Well, give us all five to start, right? In our head. You can have four. I'll take <laughs> All right. Oh, that sounds like a deal. It's um, still your turn there, Yeah, Chief. I'm thinking. It's a game of strategy. <laughs> We're all going to gain money this time anyways. I'm not worried. Uh, you know. Don't screw up. All right. See, I'm choosing the safe bet that blue is going to come out on top at the end of this round because the only thing that can realistically beat them is if you join them. No, as if purple, purple would leapfrog, but anywhere. it can't because the purple dice has already been um, played. Hypothetically, Genius. blue could roll a one and yellow could roll a... Which is exactly yeah, why I'm green. betting yellow. Whoa. And you've played hundreds of hours of this game. Yeah, so that doesn't mean I'm good at it. Okay. But All right. Even if he comes in second, I'll get a coin. Mm -hmm. So, And now we see. 
Oh, red. Okay, so Coming that was pointless. Hot. One, two, three. Okay. He was just getting warmed up. It was like <laughs> yeah. Sonic doing the spin dash back there, just waiting to Stretching charge. Stretching a little bit. Could I have one of the coins? Yeah, thank you. I think in the future for tabletop stuff, like obviously I think these mics are nice, but how nice we would should, it be to get them out of yeah, here and just have one mic here just, that can pick up totally. everything? And then we can So that was the yellow, so blue is definitely winning this round. So you <laughs> are a bit of an a-hole. Yes. <laughs> okay, great. Just wanted to confirm that. Uh, and it's your turn. Hmm. So the only dice left in there are blue, big old blue boy, and then uh, the crazy demon on wheels camel. over yes. there. <laughs> Just the nightmare from the camel's past. Um, okay. Well, I mean, I mean, hell, I guess this is the best play, right? It sure is. Lock and in I will that take blue is going to win too. The last one, yeah. Again, if people are confused about the rules, uh, let us know in the yeah. chat, and uh, Ooh, Tristan over there will take a look at it and too. yell at us. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Redo. Wait, what happened? Nothing. Okay. Huh? <laughs> Great. I was going to take this and roll, and then Grant reminded me. Yeah, because right now Yellow is in second place, so he will get a coin, too. Oh, I see. I see. But actually, um, I would have gotten the same amount of coins, because... This is only worth one if that Camel is true. comes in second mm -hmm. place. Right. And a roll only costs to one, roll two. Is one. So as well. I'll take that roll. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Appreciate it. You want Here this to go, go. Into your hand, Jeff? Him? No. <laughs> a three. Oh. oh. <laughs> I love okay. you, Blue. He's flying around this track. So that is, <laughs> that's the end of the first leg. And so now we know who has won in this round. So we will right. cash in. Uh, the leg bedding tokens that we that we were getting these square ones, and we'll get paid out for everything else that we did. Three. Uh, mm, I don't know how to count this high. <laughs> yeah, so you that's got four. <laughs> three for those two. Oh, okay. Um, okay. And then uh, one for that. So that would be four. Thank and you. I ever heard of the number six before? Oh my oh. god. <laughs> I don't know if and the camera can see that I have seven over here. <laughs> oh no! No, I made sure the camera couldn't see that. <laughs> so just so everyone knows, Ben is not winning. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Correct. Um, so people were asking about uh, the demon camels that emerge from hell. How do they work, Jeff? Um, what are they up to? Yeah, so basically there is one die in there that has both black and white numbers. Yeah. Uh, and when, But when that one comes out, basically the camel the camels move in the same way, except they will be going backwards around the track. So if they and if they if they land on a camel, do they go on the bottom? They go on top. They go on top. Yeah, okay. Right. But if other camels land on them, then they'll be getting dragged the wrong way around. Right. Straight into the bowels of hell. Mm -hmm. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Into the bowels. Correct. Yes. And it's also what's the weird rule, Grant, where it's like. I remember thinking that the game prioritizes chaos, but I don't yeah, remember yeah. how that works. If either one of these has a rider on its back, regardless of whether black or white gets rolled, it defers to whichever one has a rider on it. Mm. Mm. That's right. Perfect. Great. I'm sure the most amount of chaos. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Uh, and who is supposed to get this? I think it goes to whoever. whoever took, to the left? Or no. To the, to the left of the person who took the last took action. Took the last action. Yep. Okay. So. That's you then. Because didn't I finish off the round? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You did? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Okay, some juicy yeah, I know how it's Absolutely. how it works. All right, so I expect those gone. <laughs> <laughs> They're so good. Mm. Blue's doing real well. I'll put this right now. Mm. <laughs> I'll just start rolling because that's a sure coin. Really? Yeah. Uh oh. Okay, so that's one, two, three. Purple's <laughs> doing its best. Also, we have the heater on in the basement, so we're not dying here. Yeah, but you can probably hear. Is that right? I'm dying mm -hmm. the other way. Yes. Is that right? Absolutely. You can turn it off if you want. I mean, it's, it drops to it's like so far away. like hop in here. Okay, <laughs> right, so, your turn. So we have one bet for blue already. Ooh. Yeah. Which is probably very smart. smart. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. In some ways. Oh, and we have a Early final entry. bet. You stole my idea hey. of betting on red. Actually, hang on. <laughs> no, no, okay. on red. So that means that I'm betting that blue is going to win this whole kit and oh, caboodle. Oh, are you? 
I don't know. Yeah. I mean, it could it could, could be, be any any, any of silent them. Silent ballot, but <laughs> yeah. but we're explaining the rules. But I I promise that it will not be right, even though Blue's looking you know red hot right now. Red only knows how to run in threes. That's it's, true. That's all it knows right it's now. It's just a baby camel. That's all it knows. Okay, I'm gonna use my cheering token and I will put it there. Oil slick. Yep. Speed all boost. Right. <laughs> I'm gonna roll. Green advances one on top of yellow. Gross. I just said you weren't a pervert. <laughs> Grant Lots is of just betting. Randy for this blue camel. <laughs> I love <Yes>. blue. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like the other times well, we played blue is a journey blues. Me? <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> just secret coding <laughs> for the play of the game. <laughs> hmm. I don't care for the purple type. Yeah, I'm a. I'm what they call a big swinger. Jeff, I'm, I'm betting that one of these camels is going to lose harder than any camels ever lost in the history of camels. That's right, yes. But it could be anything. I don't know which one. Yeah, so, they, so you can also bet on which one's going to be the loser as well, yeah. which we should have mentioned, and which I should have remembered to begin with. Mm -hmm. um, I know Red's just coming in hot. I hope so too. <laughs> Yeah, just I will, tearing up the drag. I will roll again. It's got nothing to lose. One for blue. You're into that, dude? After that kind of piss no. play? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm, let's see. I'm going to take another blue card. Mm. Oh, no. Oh. One, two, three. Oh, no. <laughs> what have you wrought? Perfect. <laughs> Move that over then. Yeah. Uh, I was waiting for one of these chaos boys here. They're really just biding their time right yeah. now. But it's just like, if you could listen to them right now, it just sounds like some Lord of the Rings. Like, <laughs> <laughs> just like crazy. <laughs> Ring Yeah. <laughs> They're ready to go. <laughs> um, Man, I feel dumb for betting on red to win this whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You promised me, Red. <laughs> we were talking before the stream. <laughs> I do wish they had more personality. Wouldn't that be nice if, like, some of these camels had, like, googly eyes googly on them? Eyes. Yeah. Stuff? Yeah. Or hair. You can paint them. There's time. Oh, we could paint them, the Anissa. <laughs> yeah, I guess we could race with anything. Like, we could have... as well, long as, long as, long as they stack. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the stacking part. Mm -hmm. right. um, just lay them on top of each other. Yeah. Minis. Mm-hmm. That would work. Uh, okay. Well, I'm going to take my time. Mm-hmm. I want to see um, the ghost come out of the corner. Thank you, Jeff. Um. Yes, they yes. come in. <laughs> no fear. All right, so that is yeah. the oh, end of leg. leg two. Can we call them rounds? This leg terminology. Round, is, sure. I, I think it's, it's confusing. I think it's confusing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Second well, round, Amy cleaned up. Yeah, I got oh, eight. No. <laughs> Which is also the most amount of coins you can win by betting correctly on the final winner or Whoa. loser. So that's pretty mm. good. Yeah, hey, look. I mean, that's really good. Yeah, here's we're your, a little bit impressed. Here's your eight. And uh, I'm getting two. Coming wow. in hot. Mm. Thank you. Mm. Could I trade in I'll uh, take one. my silver coins? One big for one, the, though? The big one. One big dog? Uh, by that, I mean just one. Thank All you. Right. Hey, you know what this reminds me of? It's Bauhaus yeah. Brewery for the first Mid Max mm. meetup in Minneapolis here on Monday at 8 p.m. Jeff, are you going to go there? Yeah. What do you want to talk to folks about? What do I want to what? Talk to folks about. About whatever they want to talk about. Really? I don't know. Yeah. Your love life? What the heck they think we're doing and what yeah. we should be doing. Uh, and again, if you are outside of Minneapolis, we... Recommend moving to Minneapolis. Right. Uh, but then also we have a GoFundMe link, which should be in the YouTube description for this video. And you can go there and uh, donate to that GoFundMe account. And then we'll use those funds to buy more toys and games for kids. And I, I didn't tell you, but like I found the perfect person at HCMC Hospital to talk to on the phone today about exactly what they need. Like she was Santa. It was basically <laughs> Santa. She was a saint. Nurse Claus. Yeah, because I was 
yeah, given the runaround yesterday, trying to call the hospital to figure out like what kind of toys do you guys want? How does this well, work? Well, did you dial nine one one though? Because well, yeah. you're not supposed to do and that. And then I talked to the ambulance when it arrived because it serves as an emergency. <laughs> no, but it then is. this this lady called this morning. It called me back after I left a message, and she's like, "Oh yeah, here's exactly what we have. Like we have too many Star Wars toys. Mm -hmm. um, we have some pretty old table or like board games, but they're all missing pieces." And she's like, we just got a couple Xbox Ones. We don't have any games. And, like, she just had the exact lay of the land that we need to, like, have the most bang for the buck here. So. Nice. So I think Nintendo Switch Lights with games installed on there is going to be the sweet spot. Cool. And Xbox One games. Xbox One games, but I'm hesitant because I was like, oh, of course, you just get Game Pass for those. Like, that's the way to go. Oh, but true. then you have to be able to filter it so there's no M-rated stuff because mm, it's for true. kids and, like, the pediatric mm, ward or whatever. True. So that gets complicated. I don't think so, but then. she was talking about it because she's so smart. And she's like, we tried setting it up and I had to make a bunch of like fake email accounts to like log everybody in. And then there was like family sharing across some. She's oh, like, yeah. it was a nightmare. I didn't know what it was. So just bring us discs, please. Mm. Mm. Can they system link across uh, rooms and play Halo in there? Maybe. <laughs> Is there blood in Halo? It'd be just like the dorms. It'd be great. Okay. Yeah. I loved it. <laughs> That's what the hospitals are really like. Just like the dorms. Little dorms. <laughs> uh, the GoFundMe is doing really well, though. I know. We're almost uh, at 1,500. I really want to crack 1,500. That seems like a great place to stop. Mm -hmm. uh, feels good, too. Get in there and donate. Yeah, great. Right. You, you just donated $10 mm -hmm. there. That was amazing. Uh, also, I feel like I should introduce people a little bit more. Yeah. Grant, if you are a deep, deep fan, Grant was on one episode of A Fire Inside Ooh, Out. That's right. I was. After we saw the Black <laughs> Audio concert. Yeah. So if you know that and you're in the chat right now, Mwah, that's amazing. <laughs> the deepest of cuts. That's right. And Amy <laughs> is technically and legally uh, the producer for Min Snacks. Mm, that's right. Oh, that's right. That's, that's right. true. Grant, All my idea. That well, honestly, because <laughs> I was leaning away from the s'mores for the first episode of Min Snacks, and you were pushing for Dude, s'mores, s'mores, which I thought we were on the same page about like trying to steer cereal away from s'mores, and then you <laughs> just 180'd on me, and ended up being. He right. loves s'mores. Well, it's like yeah. the Look, man, do what he's passionate it's just, about. It's the <laughs> benchmark. Gotta have them. Somebody <laughs> asked earlier in the chat. I saw before we went live. Somebody was asking whose idea it was to put Vegemite on that s'more. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> you were just thinking mm. of like the grossest food. Well, yeah, just something that would be edible, but also potentially Te technically edible. Yeah, potentially awful. <laughs> and I, you can buy it for nine dollars at World Market. So yeah, but don't. <laughs> There's also, did you know, forty-five servings in one jar that's this big. I think oh, wow. you've got about yeah. five yeah. on yours. Yeah. Then. Okay, but that's so, the thing because like you tried it out afterwards. You put some on that yep. s'more, and, and it wasn't you're like, that bad. Yeah, I know. But then even. you asked Grant like how much in comparison, and Grant was like, "Oh, that was a minuscule oh, amount." Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> That was like a thin layer, whereas for us, it was at least the size of the marshmallow. Well, I mean, if, if Big League Chew tastes like nothing, I felt like I had to go <laughs> bigger, go big and go home with Vegemite. You thought that tasted like pumpkin spice. <laughs> <laughs> That's bad. And I hope that coward's watching. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi, Surya. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if we picked the right person for the snack show. <laughs> Why? I think that's the charm, is that it's it, it flipped more into becoming a little bit more... What is wrong with this guy? <laughs> well, just not that guy, but his tongue. It was tongue. fascinating. Like, some of those comments oh, yeah. were like, I don't understand this guy's mouth specifically. <laughs> mm -hmm. But then also there are a lot of comments of like, I've never seen Cereal's eyes like that before. They're beautiful. People are into oh, yeah. it. Wait, blindfolded? <laughs> his actual his hot his purple off. scarf of an eye. <laughs> when he took his glasses off, people were hypnotized. Wow, yeah, they were very pretty. It's like those Crystal little spirals. <laughs> <laughs> Mesmerism. Yes. I remember, we went to get that pizza, and we got in line, and I told him we were going to get the house special. And he's like, "Can we get that without onions?" <laughs> well, he's right, but no, he's not right. Not. <laughs> I feel like it's that is a special. work in progress. Yes. That was the whole point of going there was to get, like, the classic pizza. From but him. I stand by his argument of isn't the point of getting pizza, like, you make you it your like. own. The yeah. thrill of pizza is it's customizable. Sure. And, like, a good pepperoni sure. if, dipped in that green sauce, the best. If, he, if you're getting a pizza, you can get the way you want. If you're doing a snack show where you're supposed to be going out and trying different <laughs> yeah. foods. Yeah. And showcasing their signature pizzas. Yes. Yeah. No, well, sometimes true. when you're reviewing games, don't you just change all the settings to how you yeah, want and only sure. play one mode and then mm -hmm. call it good? <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I, don't, I don't actually like shooters. So. By the way, whose turn is it? Camels. Ben. It'd be um, Jeff's again. 
Yeah, because you ended another round. Oh, really? Right? Oh, wow. Okay. okay. This, so, three in a row. this podcast is about getting better, right? Mm-hmm. It's getting That's your right. tongue better. Yeah, get those so, onions in there. That's right. I know I can we need to shove better. onions down his freaking throat. <laughs> just put onions every every blind taste test for Mel. It's just going to be you know raw what's put onions. On there. It tastes really familiar. Oh. W- onions on a s'more. Onions on a s'more. Chad says absolutely. That'd be is so that pumpkin funny. spice? <laughs> I'm feeling pumpkin spice. It's a little bitter. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I love him. That, I love him. That episode is really funny. I, I oh enjoyed good. it a lot. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Okay, so that I'm going to switch my cheering one to a booing one because I really you want, want Blue to fail. You can yes. do that? Yeah. You can just move it around? Yeah. Well, That's well, my turn. This is the turn, start yeah. of a new leg or so you round take it as back. you prefer. Yeah, you take it back after every round. Okay. But oh, he didn't yeah. do that. He I, just I forgot I had left it there. Okay. I guess that's fine if you want to cheat. Perfect. Uh, I'll go turn off the heater for you, Grant, if you're dying. Oh, that's cool. It is a little steamy there. That's the camels. It's just our sensualness. <laughs> now, I, now I miss the sound. <laughs> I know. I like the sound of fans. <laughs> I have a fan on all day at work. Uh, so I'm going to do technical a Technical question. Wait, can you? Oh, you yeah, cannot. I think there so has we, to be okay. a space in between right. each one. So I could put it here, though. You yes. could. If you but really, I'm not going to. If you really dumb. have it out for purple. <laughs> Um, or I'm red, gonna go but ahead we all have sympathy and... towards red at this Excuse point. Excuse me, who? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, red's still in this race, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so I'm just kind of... It's got one leg in the loser circle. Right I want to do here. There's only one bet on the loser, yep. so I'm going to go ahead and Damn place it. my bet, because if I'm right, Damn it. and if the other person's right, I would get five coins out of that. So that is a good, good deal. I want them coins. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, everyone's, uh, everyone's copying me, Jeff. I'm... Mm-hmm. Well, technically he's copying nah, me. No, they're all copying me. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, someone's got to play the game here. Get those Advanced. camels moving. Time for some chaos. Yeah! Oh. Yeah. They well, come in. What do you think about okay. that? That wasn't it that exciting. No, not really. Let's wait yeah. till blue lands on there. Yeah, blue's going to go for the ride mm. straight to hell. <laughs> you know what we need in the studio, Jeff? Hmm. We need like a big thermometer. Because I swear to God, turning that heater off, it is now like 20 degrees cooler in this room. <laughs> well, yeah. Want to bet? Yeah, I do. <laughs> no, no, I'll turn it on a bit. Um, let's see. I like it. Like as the death camels get closer, we have to have goosebumps on our skin. So oh, it needs to yeah. like the temperatures drop. Yeah. It's like when a ghost is coming up behind you and your, your little spider sense. <laughs> okay, I'm Atmospheric. Gonna, I'm going to bet on green just to be contrarian. Oh. Interesting. Bold. And I wouldn't have done that. Yeah. Um, I know. I kind of hope it doesn't I don't work think out anyone, for you. I don't think anyone should. <laughs> three. Oh, see. Great. One, love it. One, two, three. Purple's in the lead. Who knew? Ooh, ooh boy. Oh, no. <laughs> I lost everything. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't great. All right. Uh-huh. Uh, no, it's kind of out of your reach, though. If uh. there's something easier. Okay. Um... <laughs> oh, uh, sheeple. <laughs> actually, I regret my choice. Why? Yellow and green are still in there. That's true. Oh, yeah. But so is blue and can carry us to victory here. <laughs> yeah, but blue's going to land immediately on the oil slick. We can only hope so. Not this blue. <laughs> <laughs> that blue got out like a. I'm, what's the phrase? I'm going to double down on no, green. What's the norm phrase? Camel out of hell? <laughs> norm <laughs> phrase? Come on. This is a very deep cut that's not. Applicable to the public, but what do you say about Ronnie? He got out of the gate like a real. Oh man, I'm, I'm drawing a blank. Oh. Red's limping along. Oh hey, Red! Oh, hey, oh, hey, poor Red. Red. <laughs> firecracker? I'm leaning firecracker. But okay. Hold on, let's ask him. We we'll get nah. a chance. He's busy. <laughs> He's so very he busy. Is it oh, me? Your turn. Where's that? You. Really? Because I just advanced Red. You rolled Red? Yeah. Oh. How's it possible for red to be so, so bad? bad. Yeah. It's just pretty bad. <laughs> we got left behind. We hate you. Maybe we should start advancing or like yeah. cheering for him over here so he can, you know. Oh, that's interesting. Have a Boost him up. Yeah, why not? You take your turn to do that, Amy. <laughs> well, consider it. Oh, yeah. Three. Yeah, baby. One, two, oh, three. Christ. Oh, no. yes. Oh, God damn it. Oh, they're on the chaos camel. <laughs> They've what got a taste for camel. Rocked. That is one camel unit right there. I wonder. This is a very. Video focus thing. What if you turn that sideways so that folks could see? We mean? know which way it's going. Because if it's mean? like like this way for the camera, you know, like we're on, we're on the overhead right now. 
Well, either way, it'll look the same for the overhead, but I'm saying them for that camera. It, it's not important. Tristan in the booth, can you give us the cool side shot? <laughs> Make sure it looks really cool, though. There it is. Oh, it's beautiful. How about that? Now they can see there, it. There, do you like that? Place yeah, there? it's like, it's Paper Mario, you know, you can't do the... Anyways. <laughs> Whose uh, turn is it? Did you just go? <laughs> uh, it's Ben's. Now. I don't believe so. Well, now there's nothing to live for now that we're on the back of the demons. <laughs> <laughs> we're at their whim. Man. But the odds of... I mean, got to go straight up perp down. Yeah, you That's do fair. that. Mm -hmm. I Smart. will make my final bet. Oh. Purple, huh? Purple's Never know. Get, <laughs> Never heard it drag me to hell. You're going to get dragged me to red. <laughs> the purple's gone. <laughs> Draw it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to take the last purple. Mm -hmm. Keep looking at your cards. Sorry. We got another final bet in there. <laughs> yeah. Your decision, well, Hanson. All you freaks are really... Hang on, Grant. What color are you... Grant? Is that green in your mouth? <laughs> Maybe. Okay. What kind of signal is that? I feel like there should be a bigger penalty for, for making a wrong bet. Mm -hmm. I, I don't think know so if we too. Have, I kind of feel that way too. Mm. I, if, uh, I was thinking about a house rule, like make it a minus three. Really put some weight on it. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. What did you think about, I don't know if you listened to the, the podcast this week, but uh, somebody wrote in with their house rules for just one. About mm. like putting mm -hmm. some tension on that and making it oh, like the like weird a, donation yeah, thing. I love Venmo that bet. idea. That was great. I kind of want to do it. We played just one last night. I still love that game, but it's like you have to have the right mood. But like to actually have somebody rallying for taking it super seriously, I think it'd be really fun. Um, I would like to win a dollar from a stranger. Me too. But don't you think if you got a dollar from nine random people, you wouldn't accept that dollar? It'd be like something's up. Oh yeah, like this is a scam. They're totally. gonna steal my identity. Totally. And show mm -hmm. up on my doorstep or right? something. Can you send a message? I've never. I don't have Venmo. It's weird. It's like a social media app now. It's like trying to. Hmm. They try and like communicate a lot mm, of things. It's weird. I don't have it. Don't get it. The people who gets the money is probably like frantically canceling all their credit cards. <laughs> and, like, <laughs> totally screwing up their life. Everyone who's sending oh it's like, God. yeah, we did it. We're good people. <laughs> Okay, yeah. I like it again. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's your turn. Yeah, I know. Stalling. I mean, I guess there's nothing. If anybody's my, playing... my green bet is not paying off here, is what I've learned. Whoa. Well, yeah, it's what really a loser. <laughs> if anybody's playing just thinking? one at home, though, they could donate to the GoFundMe instead of Venmo, right? Oh, that's interesting. Ooh, great yeah. idea. I think yes. that probably is a safer way to go, right? You just choose a random charity. They're always going to accept it then, right? Yeah, exactly. That's don't some take anything. Yeah. yeah. Well, don't choose a random charity. A good one. How many evil charities are there? I Lessons. feel like there's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I think like the Fourth Reich as a charity? <laughs> no. Okay. But just, you know, people who are, you know, skimming off the top don't appreciate that. Oh, interesting. Which yeah, is why I think it's going to be so cool when you buy all the toys and hopefully show everyone what you get. Yeah, for sure. Like a shopping spree like mm -hmm. on Instagram. Yeah. I think it's probably the best way to do that. I don't know. Are you going to the hospital too yourself? I was debating it. It seems like – but I also – I'm hesitant because – I probably will. But I'm hesitant because like it's Bauhaus's charity and we're just like helping out mm -hmm. with it. And sure. so I don't want to – Don't steal the thunder. A little bit because even like I searched Sweet Toys for Sick Kids and we're like the number one search over them. And so it's like eh. – but it, it, yeah. but it gets in that weird murky thing of like it's all for charity, so yeah. I can't imagine there's a lot of ego from them involved. How upset can they be? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Right. Yeah. So I don't know. Especially um, if you are partnering with them, I mean, yeah, you're gonna be mentioning their name and everything. They're a part of it. Yeah, I think so. Um, Just bring the kids a bunch of beer from Bauhaus. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is that what they do? <laughs> Probably. Mm -hmm. I think that's the way that works. All right, I was going to give a little speed boost to Red, but I guess Red's already <laughs> shot his wad anyway, so there's no that point. That was your one grand scheme. <laughs> that whole period of stalling. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, I mean, what do you think of this? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that Red? That's Red. Fancy. <laughs> Better believe it. Uh, I'm... Yeah, you can win a dollar back after you, you know, lost a bunch. Yeah, that's about <laughs> as good as I can hope for. Three. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, it's so One, close. Two, three. It was so close to payout. <laughs> <laughs> Keep was, dreaming, you uh, hag. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. So if the camel unit did land on this, you would have gotten an extra dollar. I'm turning the yep. gear back on. All right. We were so mm. close. Okay, so that's the end of the round. So. Not the leg, the round. I uh, prefer leg. 
So this is negative two for me and one. So I owe one. Which is perfect. That's exactly how you want a round to go. Yeah, that's what you get for betting on <laughs> that freak of nature green camel. Yeah. It has a I get four. Pretty good shot to win this whole thing right now. Can I have one silver? Sure. If you think about oh, it, actually, only the yellow camel yeah, looks gold. anatomically correct. Wait, what? I mean, they're what? all like freak colors, except for yellow is like the mm. default camel color. Ben, uh, what you six. got over there? Oh, man. Aren't no camels thing? camel colored? Is that right? Because there's a color called camel, isn't there? Is it it's really? Brown. Is yeah. it in like Crayola 64 pack? I'm sure. No. Maybe 128. It's like when you buy a jacket, a jacket that's kind yeah, of brown, Jeff. it'll be called, you know, it's in the color camel. It's no, camel that's camel fur. Colored jacket. No. <laughs> Pretty sure. No one's going to wear a camel fur jacket. <laughs> I would. Well, yeah, Jeff would. He's a huge fan of this game. That's right. Tristan, Google that for us, please. <laughs> a camel <laughs> coat. A camel coat. A camel coat. Uh, and I finished oh. it off, right? Oh, so oh Amy gets to Finally, go first. Finally, someone else can go first. That's right. Mm -hmm. Oh, there. Got to put oh. this back in oh, yeah. to our pyramid. I love this dispenser. Mm -hmm. This is like the coolest part of the good. game. Yeah. yeah. In the in the first edition, I think it was like cardboard, mm -hmm. and it oh, had yeah. a rubber band around it. Like oh. a little this is really tight. Tab on it. Yeah. Some Labo garbage. Yeah. Satisfying button. <laughs> There was no tree in the first edition either. I know. I that. mean, you need the tree. Mm -hmm. We all right. love the tree. I think I'm going to do something risky. I'm just going to, off the bat, I'm going to do purple. Mm. I'm taking purple. Huh. It could pay off. For the leg. Five point. Yeah, for the leg. Okay. Also known as round. Mm -hmm. But we do cash out the round ones even, at, even if someone wins as well. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. For the people at home. If ah. they don't understand. I am... I'm petrified of that that black and white dice. I know. I'm shaking on you. <laughs> so he far, could really they literally moved like one. <laughs> this is the <laughs> chance, though. Look at that. Look at that unit. Well, roll. It see what knows. happens. Also, I mean, yeah, the powers of Satan himself, they know when there's camels on top and when that dice has got to come out. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Extra gravity. I oh, think. yeah. So you want to roll? I can pass you a little coin. Careful. Careful. Do you want it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Come on, Gray. Damn it, Gray. One. Whoa, well, welcome to my hell, purple. Green. <laughs> <laughs> That's my freaking purple, Can you throw that dice on a tent oh. for me? Yeah. Thank you. Huh. Right, Your turn, Hanson. No. You... I mean, honestly? Look at old boy Yellow over there. Yeah, I'm going with uh, old, old Yeller. Hmm. Interesting. Because if blue Very or a purple rolls a three, that's... That's GG for yellow. Um, well, well. Wait doing another. <laughs> Did you just bet on yellow? I take it back. To win? <laughs> I'll never tell. Win. Don't tell them, but tell the microphone. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I bet yeah. on okay, green. I Sorry, what was that? I'm going to put the headphones on real quick. <laughs> mm, okay, I'm going to take a yellow now, too. Everybody's just chosen for yellow. I mean, it's the default camel color. Yeah, it's the most camel accurate color mm -hmm. here so obviously mm -hmm. a winner yeah nothing's better than a factory hey you know what let's get this party started oh man come on come on chaos come on chaos no. ah! three oh my gosh ah! one you dirty dog. two three green wins green wins it takes her home oh, wow oh my gosh red Poor Red. <laughs> <laughs> Bring it out back. That oh is my god. All four hooves in the slaughterhouse. Though. He is. That is one sad camel. Sad day. Have we seen one right. end that far back before? I don't <laughs> think so. I mean, yeah, we didn't even get in. A clean run, too. No slicks, no nothing. <laughs> Everything no in his favor. The crowds were chanting his name, which we forget now, but. Little Jesus. buddy. That's Little his name. butt. And the hell camels just did nothing the whole time. Cowardly. They were yep. pointless. Yeah. They scared no one. We opened that pit to hell, the gateway to hell, and this is what you give us? Bummer. So round winnings, did anyone, everyone lost on their, oh, Grant? Oh, I bet nope. on green, yeah. He got a big fiver over there. So, Mine evened out, so. Mm, I bet on yellow like some idiot, and so because he was back three, then I, Oh, you mm -hmm. But you also get one from that. Ah, so you break so you even. So even hands off. I don't, I don't want that. Oh, you sure? I'm sure. I'll put it in the Just stack. put it in the bag. 
Uh, yep, one for Grant. Okay, it now only took two two dice that round. That's why. Finish things up. All right. Do you want to go through the winner stack or the loser stack first? I think. Oh, loser stack. Yeah, yeah. loser Oops. stack's more fun. I think we. I think I we know what's in the there. Unit. Oh, it could be anything. Could be. Jeff's a wild card. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> you just Jeff flip these over. So the black. first one red was. The, the pretty lady. Thank you, lady. Lady. pretty lady. Oh, That's man. eight coins. Eight big ones. You for suck, Red. <laughs> I'm taking this money out of your hide, buddy. There you go. Uh, number two, mustache oh, man. That's me. That is a five. That's fiber. Thank you, sir. And then Grant. All right. With three. It's the fine. What a yeah. what a failure Red was. Holy yeah. mackerel. Clean it up. I lost, and you <laughs> won, obviously. All right, and then we've got the... Oh, yeah, there's still this one. The winning bets. Oh, I need this. Oh, I need this. Grant first with blue. You idiot. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Remember you thought blue was the champion? That was... That was <laughs> who I am. One coin... And Hanson also blue. I stand by that decision. <laughs> you <Yeah>. idiot. <laughs> what do you need from me? Cough one. it up. I pay you one? Absolutely. Yeah. You, you pay the bank. Okay. The bank always wins. <laughs> After that, we went to purple, which was me. That uh, was a failure. But very clo close. It was very yep. close. And then another purple from Grant. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> we, we were betting all over the place. Blowing it. <laughs> And then See, a purple was, from Hanson. God, <laughs> why? See, if this was minus three, mm -hmm. the bank would just be rolling in dough right now. And then one winner for me with that was eight coins. Wow. Hang on. Notice he's wearing long sleeves, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> he's doing Show some wheeling and dealing. <laughs> <laughs> he's got the backup cards he in his sleeves. That. And that's everything for cashing out? Is, is that right? Yeah. I was right. still failed big time. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, oh, what, 19 <laughs> here. I had 12. <laughs> I got 20. Uh, 24. Ah! Thank wow. you. Good job. You Good truly job. know camels. Thank you. Yep. Way to go. Uh, Tristan, how's the chat doing? Oh, pretty good. Right. What, is, what are they talking about? Let's see. There's one person who asked, uh, any way you can do a house rule before each game starts to bet that X will be Y? That way people might be more enticed to use their boost on stragglers. Mm. Tristan, okay. Mm. Yeah, to use... A house rule so that people are more tempted to use the boost. Yeah, the people, the boost, I feel like I don't really feel compelled to use that often. Mm -hmm. Have you noticed that, Jeff, in your games too? Yeah, sometimes. Um, I think we used it more when we weren't using the crazy camels, which. Right, I think that's night. probably it. It's just like a weird legacy thing. Because, yeah, if you didn't have the crazy camels, mm -hmm. I, I could see being more incentivized to mess around with that stuff. Yeah, or, you know, like. I was using it because everyone had already placed their bets, so I was just trying to screw you guys over at that right, point. Right, naturally. <laughs> seems like a pretty good idea. But there's probably... Oops. Uh, I just mixed a bunch of these cards. Take my lovely mind. lady. Thank you. That's great. But everybody can, everybody can follow the game okay, it seems like? Yep. Am camera? I, I'm missing a card. A little bit closer to the, uh, the camera. Well, when we're explaining the rules and yeah. stuff, Tristan says hold the cards closer to the camera. Thank you. That's helpful. Here we go. Oh, okay, oh, yeah, the winning sure. round in particular, he says. Let's play again. Yes, this okay. time for keeps. For real, yeah. yeah. How about uh, joking um, around? Loser donates uh, 20 bucks to that uh, GoFundMe. <laughs> Turning it <laughs> into gambling? <laughs> yes, gambling for charity. Well, uh, the true nature lose, of gamble so. <laughs> That's true. You, you up for it? Let's do it. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Okay, great. Sure. And if you're watching, that link is in the YouTube description, I believe. If you want to support uh, buying toys and games for kids. Here's All right. Spot. I didn't think about board games uh, to donate at Bauhaus either. That's a great idea. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. But, I mean, you don't have that big of a collection. Would you really part with any of them that you have? Well, that's the thing where I thought that Bauhaus and the Sweet Toys for Sick Kids charity wanted new toys they that say were new but unsealed which is the weird so distinction and he kind of gave me like a new wish just not some used crap is kind of the idea i believe like to me it sounded like they wanted it unwrapped like don't wrap it in as a present oh sure yeah. like a new toy but ungift wrapped yeah. that could be they just need to know what it is I yeah think so. Mm -hmm. so we were planning uh, on inventory. going to um a store like five below because they have a lot of really cool toys and stuff like that yeah that that's five dollars or less just loading up yeah, yeah. You just get a bunch of stuff there because they're going to just douse you in beer. They're going to be like, I all right, here's so. your ceremonial beer bong. Stand on this table and <laughs> accept so. the charity offerings. Yeah, and they have really good beer, too. So Where did the uh, crazy camels go? 
Uh, we have to do, do we a just roll, roll for that, too? Yep. So you roll for them individually? So yep. black oh, okay. goes there. Oh, I see. Kelsey's saying blow on the camels, which she says a lot, actually, is blow camels, which is very odd. <laughs> Oh, that's a very good idea. So Edgar Vasquez says the losers donate the difference between them and the winner sure. to the funds. That sounds great. Let's do that. We're all shaking. Right, Jeff? Mm, You're good for the petrified. money? Petrified. Yeah. Great. Can't lose. I can't afford this. <laughs> <laughs> the only way to make it up is for more people to support the Patreon. It's okay. a loop. Who starts? Is there a rule for who's supposed to start? Whoever's holding that, so just go for oh, it. great. Okay. Wait a minute. She has a red card, ladies and gentlemen. I saw it. <laughs> yeah, we all have our cards intact. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and roll because I'm standard. Three for yellow. I've always loved yellow. I have one, no problem with two, yellow. Three. Honestly, yellow is one of my favorite colors. It's Can great. I have a roll token too? I can't quite reach those. Thank you. And a pyramid. Love one pyramid for you. Oh, the weird thing. Ooh. Your oh. roll got botched a little. By we got a botch roll? <laughs> by our botched board. Good old botch board. It's a little wobbly. Well, because it has to be it's on the okay. mic, was, we'll fix it next time around, right? Yeah. <clears throat> um, okay. Okay. Well, purple's mm -hmm. doing pretty well here. Mm -hmm. I mean, it could be in the lead. Could be in the lead. I'm a... Uh... Yeah. You know what? You can't really do much here, can you? Other than win. Big time. Great. That's one, one blue. That's one winning blue. right there. Oh, this is a winner's move. Mm-hmm. So let's see. We got purple and we got green. Yeah. I'll mm -hmm. bet I'm blue. Mm -hmm. Jeff, have you had good experience introducing like non-gamers to this game? Have you ever been... Has anybody ever said, F this, this is too hard? Because mm -mm. I was going to introduce my parents to it over Thanksgiving, and I was like, I'm too worried about it. I think it's too complicated. Really? Didn't even give them a chance? Did not give them a chance. Oh, man. They complained a lot about skulls. So. Really? <laughs> but they eventually well, got there. skulls is kind of hard. Like, it's harder we, than you think. Yeah. Well, off the bat, it's kind of hard. When we played skulls at first, it's like hard to try to wrap your mind around the whole, like trying to calculate the like how many the skulls? Odds? Yeah, the odds in the beginning, right. like not being able to see it at first. Big bluff Ben over there trying to throw you off your game too. <laughs> That's yeah. right. Yeah, and mm -hmm. so if you say like, "Oh, I could do six, it's like, "No, you can't." Oh yes, you can. No, you can't. Especially when you have a skull of your own. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's like a, it's there's a little bit of a learning curve there. Yeah, I mean, I've always loved blue. It's the prized camel. Yep. I'm seriously considering betting everything on blue right now. Hmm. You should. Maybe left. I will. Yes, ah. the darkness grows. Oh yeah, and that's the end you of take the a round. Green token, so I could load up too. The green. Yeah. No, because I got the same amount here, and then you got one dollar less. This is true. And I want to win. Well, <laughs> I want the kids to win. I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> oh I'm gonna God. botch it as hard as possible. Good call. Oh Throw this round. <laughs> I got seven. Good God. I got three. Thank you. And you have to donate it, um, but the name of the donation has to be the color of the camel that has really effed you. <laughs> Can we name the camels and then? Uh, three, Grant. All right. Oh, the, well, they're all named their colors. That's right? boring. I guess it's not really getting into their content of their character at all, is it? It's not at all. You got a two-y. Two for the bottom of that One stack. Oh lord. Okay, who went uh, last? You took the last roll. So then it's you. Thank you. Um, can you grab me a roll token? Thanks. Green? Mm hmm. That's a fine thing. I always tent with that first tent. Hmm. What an oddity. I know what I would do. Oh, you do? I mean, oh. yeah, I guess. I guess it makes sense, right, Jeff? 
No. Nope. Oh my god. <laughs> Hang on, this is a disaster. You <laughs> fool. No. You chose wrong. Just kidding, that was it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take my blue one. Oh, blue eyes. What the hell? Well, now what? <laughs> We've exhausted all of our hopes and dreams. Time to start betting on green. I mean... Brian Mackey asks, does it cost anything to use a boost, non-boost? Brian it asks, a turn. Yeah, just a turn. Yes, however, if someone lands on the boost, you get a coin for it. Mm. So it could pay off that way. There's a, so far it hasn't. <laughs> there's yeah. some, some weird rules, too. Um, like right now, if green with blue on its back was to land on a... Uh, backwards one. Yeah. If it goes backwards, it slides under a stack, and there's mm -hmm. one behind it too, versus going on top. Mm -hmm. So it's like a, a double reversal kind of thing. We should start playing it the, the tokens, so then we can demonstrate how it's supposed to work. Go Three, blue! There go goes. blue! That's my boy. That dude is on fire. What blue? Yeah. Both rounds out of the gates. We saw what happened last time. Yeah, though. Red, will you at least look at Blue so you know <laughs> what a real camel should be doing with See its what life? what speed looks like? <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Huh. I will start betting. Very interesting. You realize you got We're going for it. We're here. going for it. <laughs> All right. It's your funeral. It's I'm going to put my cheer token down right here. It's not a bad hoping move. Hoping that one of these will land on it and they'll advance a little further. Because you want to... What's the advantage of that? Uh, the advantage is I will get a dollar. I'll get a dollar coin for every one that lands on it. And yeah. these will get closer to these to make it a little bit more of a interesting race. But you're already betting on blue. Well, yeah. A but, little I bit. mean, that's obvious. They're not going to... Right. You know... They're I mean, not going to win this. I mean, these, these losers. <laughs> yeah. I mean, don't let them hear, but we all know what this They're is. They're lining up for the glue factory right now. <laughs> um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So it's worth one if I were to take that greeny, but I guess I'll just. Which is you know what? You know what? Yeah, I'm going to do that, actually. I was overthinking it. Red goes Great. One. Now this Sad. is a play. He's doing it. Should have gone two. Hmm. Yeah. Let's just keep keep it simple. Oh God. They move Here they come. At They're growing. Night. They know the more powerful is a C unit. I'm gonna take the last roll. All right. Somebody land on my token. My cheer token. Hey, they Yay, did it. Yay, it did. So purple advances one, two, three onto my cheer token. So it'll go one further. I'm just going to give you a dollar right now so I don't forget. Awesome. All right, and that's the end of the round. Hey, there it is. So I'll take my token back. Feel pretty good about that token, huh? Oh, yeah, it worked that time. I've got... Oh, bears? Or... No, just throw do it, though. Do you want the coins in there, too? Just throw one bear. Into his mouth? Yeah. Hello? Oh, oh, <laughs> Perfect. It was actually a bullet. <laughs> I've got a three and one for four. I get three. I only know one toss and speed, Ben. <laughs> Lightning fast. Three. Three. Oh, actually, I'll fast ball. <laughs> oh yeah. Yep. Uh, seven. Cool. Whoa. Seven big O's. Jesus. Not bad. Thank you. I know how to camel. Get a whopping three. Jeff, I know your posture isn't great, but have you ever had the hump of a camel? No, thank you. <laughs> great. What's the weirdest food you've ever had? Is it the hump of a camel? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what... It's not camel, though? No. Or bugs or any, any of the other stuff that the extra life folk get into yeah you've always said no to that yep why is that because but you also you're like exotic with your food you like going to restaurants or whatever i like yeah i like actual food not <laughs> bugs and i gag just watching you guys eat that stuff kyle so. has a taste for it now <laughs> he likes it yeah he loves it he puts it on his cereal in the morning 
perfect. Neat. You can't think of the weirdest food you've eaten? Um, I think like, I know it's not some outlandish, crazy foreign thing, but like oysters, just objectively, is probably the weirdest thing you can put in your mouth, right? It's pretty odd. It's very odd. I guess. Yeah. It's just o- ocean snot. Mm-hmm. That people pay yeah. money for. It's yeah. a disaster. A lot of money for. Yeah. Considering it's like one little weird slurp of snot. It's <laughs> <laughs> all you, Ben. Yeah, it's your turn. You saying this is game point? No. No, not at all. Is that what you're saying to me, Grant? Not at all. <laughs> you say it all comes down to this, huh? I mean, I really want the opposite of these. I want bet on the loser that round. Yeah. Well, I think that's like a house rule. I mean, you, you could, could bet oh, on you could bet on the loser. You just wouldn't it's not get, anything get you anything. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I guess that's true. I guess that's true. God, those demons. I think I'm gonna who those two they aren't doing anything. <laughs> those two pussy cats over there. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. Exactly wow. as planned. I mean, they're making a compelling case back there for who the loser is going to be. That's a mm-hmm. tightly contested race. Oh, That's ketchup true. and mustard back there. <laughs> <laughs> ketchup and mustard in the rear, they say. Uh, I will put my cheer token. Mm-hmm. I either want to put it here or here. Mm, probably here. I'll put it here. Yeah. By the way, I just noticed like, the art on the board. I like how the stands are only like half full at best. It's like even they're acknowledging like I mean, camel it's camels, races. Yeah, yeah. You know. It's not that great. Yeah, when the horse races are full, you come to this freak show. Purple advances one, two. So you missed my cheer token. Sorry. Bummer. Hmm. Hmm. Green, what are you up to? All right. I'm feeling good about Bluey. Sure. Come Only on. takes one roll to <laughs> I know. De- <laughs> dethrone the king up there. Nah, that wasn't the one, but Darn. exactly. Put his hump in his place up there. <laughs> Grant, your turn. Yeah. Just gonna roll. If you can grab me a token, that'd be sweet. My pleasure. Hey, it's on your oh, chair. There you go. Yes. See, one you help me out with the token, I help Wait, you. Wait, no, no, no. There. So Red. the yellow actually oh, stays behind. Yep. Correct. Amy said that nicer than I did. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Thank you. What are you sure. doing? <laughs> Half and up here. And so you're going to have to give me a coin. Cough it up, Fanker. Yeah, that's nicely. Got a lot of ones yeah. over there, Amy. Yeah. Hoarding them. Making it rain mm-hmm. for myself. I'm not going to trade those in. <laughs> This pink has dignity. <laughs> Too big to fail. All right. It's chaos time. Ooh, oh, it is. yes. One, two, oh, six, my six, God. Six. It's getting close. That's uh, the end of the round. It is. Great. Let's well, cash in. You want right. more blue? Two. Thank you. Jeff? I got five. Oh, okay. <laughs> I saw it, the way he was looking at blue. Uh, Three. Three. I think you're a little overly confident in blue. Here you are. Shevin. Can you stack these for me? Sure. Thank you. Remember in Return of the Jedi when the Emperor's like, your faith in your friends is yours, like in terms of like greatest weakness or whatever? Mm -hmm. What is that a retaliation or retort to? What does Luke say to him? Like, Uh, what is your greatest weakness? Your confidence? It's it's when the the shield generators are still on... um, is it Endor? Is that yeah. where the, the yeah. moon of Endor? Are you doing this? Uh, so you can trade in a few of those. I'm running oh. low on silver. But what does he say? Does he say your confidence is your weakness? Your yeah, your confidence in your friends is yours. Your over. No. wait. Is that what it is? Because Luke, wait. It's like, <laughs> I'm afraid oh the gosh. shield generators will be quite operational when Ooh. your friends arrive. <laughs> right. <laughs> Isn't there something about your faith in your friends is your greatest weakness, though? Yeah. But isn't it, and wh- then what's the retort? Is that what you want? Yeah, what's the part before that? Like why? Because isn't that? it like? Isn't he say your faith in your friends is yours? Isn't that the line? I think so. Okay, Tristan's Tristan googling it. Yeah, <laughs> I'm counting on the chat to, to get, pull it through. Typing. 
I've Kelsey? never heard somebody type faster. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, Kelsey, Kelsey put up your Blu-ray. All of the words. Blue to Camel everyone. Ray. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what is it, Tristan? Tristan, this is no time to search ugly toes. Your overconfidence is your weakness. Your overconfidence is your weakness is what Luke says. Yes. And then the emperor says, your faith in your friends is yours. Because he's so confident about those field generators. Yes. Being operational. (laughs) Wait, I thought it was the Death Star that was fully operational. Does he use the word operational as well? Yeah. Everyone's operational. Um, Who did the last last action? Did I? I don't remember. Somebody rolled the... Was it? Oh, it was me. Yeah. So you start. Jesus. It's hard to remember. It's like the fourth time it is. <laughs> yeah. Um, you have a little oil Thanks. slick out there, too. Yeah. Easy now. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? <laughs> I don't know. I have so little faith in yellow right now. But red. I thinking of betting on yellow. Red, I remember you from last game. You were dreadful. <laughs> Your faith in red <laughs> is yours. <laughs> He's just waiting to screw it up. <laughs> I'm too I'm too scared right now to do anything big. Come on, Death Camel. Oh, Ooh, yellow. One, two. I almost bet against you, yellow. <laughs> Jeff, um, you um you check out a lot of board game coverage. Mm-hmm. Do you do a lot of other sites do interviews with creators? Is it just that I've never read one? Uh, like written interviews either way or like videos when people go to uh, like conventions a lot then they'll grab random people so and the interview. quality just sucks like it's convention interviews are not yeah. interviews come on everybody what's the nearest board game convention to us that's that's happened is it uh, there in is one scene? there is one I think it's called con of the north oh um, <laughs> fitted oh. yep and Weird. I, I can't remember when it is I want to say it might be coming up I think it's in winter sometime, so mm-hmm. perhaps we shall have to go. What do you think about this? We hate it. I like it. You <laughs> fool. <laughs> <laughs> That's blue, right? That's right. Knew it. As soon as he jumps on that uh, chaos unit there. In my um, mind, C stands for chaos. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll just keep. Oh, you're going to regret that so hard. Oh, probably. Man. You're nuts. Probably. Mm-hmm. He's going to take mm-hmm. a mm-hmm. walk on the wild side I know. over there. I know, Hanson. <laughs> okay. Can you so. tip him forward and make it look like he tripped just to... <laughs> 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 oh, uh, uh, I suppose it's behind the pyramid. I'm so stupid. Let the record show he tripped. <laughs> he's, he's down. <laughs> <laughs> For the count. By the way, Jeff, I'm, I, I'm endlessly I'll tickled I'll by Whoa. the idea that, like... You would not come over to my house for nine years <laughs> until the layoff and happened. Then you come over. And I've been trying to play board games with you day. for nine years. And you also wouldn't <laughs> oh do it until gosh. I put a camera on. Then you're like, oh, I guess I'll come over. <laughs> That's right. If I can get some Twitter followers out of it, as Listen, you said. Listen, Hanson, I've told you so many times that I spent so much time with you when we were at GI. I see. More time with you than my wife. <laughs> and so do I want <laughs> to leave my wife right. at night to yeah. spend more time with you? Yes. <laughs> Does she like tabletop games? Too? Yeah. She does, yeah. Oh, interesting. We play, interesting. We play games. Oh, we can have a hot oh, duel. Yeah. Just you two playing chess for like six hours? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> really? Two person game Angrily. and just one. <laughs> 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 Who's go? Uh, I think it's me. I went. I'm oh, yeah. Strongly yep. debating. Mm. Just go with Blue Man. We all love him. I'm looking at that, at that uh, green, uh, green purple unit there. I think it's poised to strike. No way. It is. Yeah, strike the toilet. What if it jumps on... <laughs> well, put it that way. What if it jumps on top of blue? Maybe we'll you for a show. see what's going to happen. Maybe I should. Do you want to roll? Yeah. I'm too scared to <laughs> make a stance and bet on purple. Yes. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Welcome to the, the wild side. Oh. Where's your blue now? No, that's not good. Just <laughs> kissing death in the face. Um. By the way, it's very funny to me that like their big addition for round two, one of them is like that stupid tree, and it's just like there's it's not nothing. Stupid. Well, I know I love the tree, but in terms of like just the angle for trying to live stream board games, it is like the worst <laughs> thing. It's like let's just put an obstacle <laughs> for all of the action for that camera. <laughs> it's very silly. I mean, that's on us for putting the tree there too. It's like we could have. <laughs> what do we just rip it out? Way. No, for a tree removal service. Twist the board. Yeah. Well, I guess you could, but come on. The thing doesn't bring you joy every time you pop the board open. Yeah, I like it's it. It's a good tree. I'm not bashing the tree. Sounds like you are. Well, it does sound like that. <laughs> yeah. 
Yep, yep, yep. We all know where this is going to go. Mm-hmm. But let's see it. Unless, am I blowing it? No. No, I can't. Come Don't on. Blow it. I can't and I won't. That's too. Wow. Good work, Red. We all regret laughing at you. You're a real <laughs> champion now. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. um. Yeah, no, let's... I'll take the one guaranteed coin. What a cool move. Two. Oh, God. man. I'm waiting for that huge death swing. Make it happen, Amy. I'm going to bet on oh. it again. <laughs> You're betting against Doubling the death down. swing? Come That's right. On. It's a 50-50 chance. 50 yep. right now. It I'm, could be... I'm taking the big bet. Could be purple. I mean... Worst case scenario, I would a coin. Yeah. Best case scenario, I'm up five. Mmm. I want to see it. I want to make this effing thing happen. Death, come out to play. Purple me, bro. Ah! Yeah. Oh. So, Hell yeah. That didn't work out that great for blue, but it's not the worst. Oh, that's the end of the round. It is. It's the end of the yeah. round, yeah. All right, gonna, I get two. I'm just going to cash in real quick. Just two. Can you throw that purple on top there for me? Sure. Thank you. I'll take two, Grant. Coming right up. Thank you, banker. Mm -hmm. Oh, jeez. <gasps> I will take two as well. Open your mouth this one. Ah. <laughs> yeah. you. How two. many? Two. Two measly coins. Ben took the last turn? Yes. 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 Indeed. Okay. Hmm. You know what? I have a, like, the it's computer cute. running that Camel Slideshow, which is pretty hot, is a, <laughs> it's like Windows XP? I think. Like, it's just this old ass laptop <laughs> to the point that, like, I can't Google images on there. I have to shovel, like, shuttle it over on a thumb drive. Because, like, <laughs> CRT and oh Windows God, XP. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Grant, can I change in five for Yeah, for sure. It's also your turn. G Man. My turn already? Mm -hmm. And you have to hand me five. What did, uh. Get out of here and open up. <laughs> <laughs> what did you two do? None of your business. Uh oh. I made a bed. Making moves. I may bet too. Very interesting. That's very interesting. Yes. Oh no. I'm gonna put this purple one over here. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Purple yeah. one on the loser? Oh yeah. It's going down hard. Interesting. <sighs> all right. Stick to the plan. Stick to the plan here. And we all know what the plan is. Wait. Oh, what's wait. going uh, on? We haven't. <laughs> <laughs> Not in the pyramid. <laughs> We forgot to put those back. <laughs> Did that influence this. your guys' choices? No. Okay. <laughs> I assumed it was a new round. All right. Now stick to the plan. I think. Yeah. We don't know what the hell's going on here. Ah, what do you think about that? I think that changed now? nothing. <laughs> <laughs> At least yellow gets to feel slightly better about themselves. Yeah. Uh, Okay, okay. Bet on purple. Interesting. Oh, yeah. Hope this chaos camel takes purple. I know. Take Far it for a ride. Away. Yeah! Oh, no! <laughs> oh! <laughs> See you in hell, purple! <laughs> One, yes. two, three. Oh, the no. Dark Lord rises. Um, so, uh, it actually goes like this, and yellow goes on top, doesn't it? Is that right? Yep. No. Doesn't no. it? No. Only if there was an oil slick type thing. It'll go underneath. Oh, out of batteries. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay. I was curious how long that would last. Turns out not long. All right, I'll fix it. Don't mind me. 
Well, that screwed everything up. <laughs> yes, it did. Wow. Uh, this, this makes us a... Do you want to get your name or Twitch or YouTube channel in the description of everything we release? Record a podcast with us? Put a picture of your choice on MinMax's TV or a whole lot more? You can check out the benefits for supporting us on Patreon. If you support MinMax at any tier on Patreon, you can submit questions or comments for us to read on the air, and you'll also get access to the wonderful MinMax Discord. We need your help to keep this whole indie trainer rolling, so we'd appreciate it if you checked us out.